But in the beginning, there was, here's Harold. I grew up in a segregated city thinking that African Americans were never going to get the opportunity to rule and to govern. And Harold Washington changed all that forever. Watch the city of Chicago destroyed by petty politics right. and bad government. Right. I have been urged by the earnest pleas of thousands of people to enter this race. Therefore, I hereby declare my candidacy. Earl wasn't taken seriously. None of this was taken seriously. I don't want to be married if you homeless. I wasn't getting covered outside of the African American community. Okay, the schedule is 9 o'clock. We did not have any money, and we were pretty low in the polls. We have 670,000 black registered voters in this city. And we have never argued that we want anything short of a coalition. When you get right down to it, the votes are here. They're here. They're here. There was a groundswell, and all you had to say is Harold was coming. from Harold Washington's 1983 mayoral acceptance speech. You want Harold? Well, here's Harold. Tonight, we are here to celebrate a resounding victory. We have fought a good fight. We have finished our course, and we have kept the faith. We fought that good fight. We fought it with unseasoned weapons and a phalanx of people who mostly have never been involved in a political campaign before. Today, Chicago has seen the bright daybreak for this city and for perhaps this entire country. The whole nation is watching as Chicago sent a powerful message out of the crucible of this city's most trying election, carried on the tide of the most massive voter turnout in Chicago's history, blacks, whites, Hispanics, Jews, Gentiles, Protestants, and Catholics of all stripes have joined hands to form a new democratic coalition and to begin in this place a new democratic movement. To those who supported me, I offer my deepest thanks. I will initiate your reforms, but I charge each and every one of you to rededicate your efforts to heal the divisions that have plagued us. Each of us must reach out in open arms. Together, we must overcome our problems and restore Chicago to its proper position as one of the most dynamic cities in all the world. To those of you, wherever you are, who have opposed this election, I assure you that I understand your needs and desires. I know I can rely on you for your assistance and cooperation. Chicago is one city. We must work as one people for our common good and common goals. Our main concern at this moment is unity. History was made tonight, and this history has been coming up on the horizon. It's been talked about in our streets and homes, but there is nothing like victory that makes an old track man like me glad he dared to enter this race. A great adventure has begun right here. I am so proud to be a part of this great adventure. 
I am so humbled by the fact that you have seen fit to give me the responsibility to lead that adventure. So to all of you here, to all of you out there who worked so hard for this day, to those of you all over the country who wished us well, who sent us some of your children to work with us and pray for us. God bless you all and thank you from the bottom of my heart.